Hello everyone, you are welcome. How to solve this beautiful exponential math problem, which is 3 raised to power a is equal to 8 raised to power 9. So here we will try to find out the value of a. Now how can we solve this math problem? Here first of all we will try to eliminate these two powers a and 9 from the powers. So first of all we will try to eliminate this a from the left hand side. Now to eliminate this a from the left hand side we will, we will take 1 over a in power in both sides. So let us take 1 over a in the power in both sides this will become 3 raised to power a or raised to power 1 over a is equal to a raised to power 9 or raised to power 1 over a. Now here in both sides of this equation we will use an exponential identity and we multiply the powers with each other. So this equation will become 3 raised to power a times 1 over a is equal to this will become a raised to power 9 times 1 over a now here this a and this a will be cancelled this will become 3 raised to power 1 which is simply 3 so this equation will become this is simply 3 is equal to this will become a raised to power 9 times 1 over a now what we will do here here we will try to eliminate this 9 from the right hand side now to eliminate this 9 from the right hand side here we will take 1 over 9 in power in both sides so let us take 1 over 9 in power in both sides so this will become now again here in the right hand side we will use an exponential identity and we multiply this 1 over 9 with this number so this will become imply this will become 3 raised to power 1 over 9 is equal to this will become a raised to power we can write this as 1 over 8 times 9 times 1 over 9. So here this 9 and this 1 over 9 will be cancelled. So this will become only 1. So this power will become 1 over a. So further we can write this equation as we will write this in the left hand side and this in the right hand side. So this will become a raised to power 1 over a is equal to 3 raised to power. 1 over 9. Now my just to get to the left hand side here this base and this number in the denominator is same. So like this here we will try to make this number and this number same. So for that here we multiply and divide 3 in the power. So let's multiply 3 and divide. So next we can write this right hand side is here the left hand side will be the same here is 2 power. 1 over a is equal to and we can write this as 3 raised to power 3 times 1 over you multiply these two numbers so 9 times 3 is 27 now again here in the right hand side we will use an exponential identity and we will out this power 1 over 27 so this equation will become implies a raised to power 1 over a is equal to we can write this as 3 is to power 3 all is to power 1 over 27 now what is the value of 3 is to power 3 3 is to power 3 means we have to multiply 3 3 times so 3 times 3 is 9 and 9 times 3 is 27 so this is 27 so we will replace this with 27 so this will become implies l is to power 1 over a is equal to 27 is to power 1 over 27 now my just to get to both sides here the basis and the number in the denominator are same so from here we can compare the basis as well as the powers so from both comparing we will get the same solution so let us compare the powers so this gives them 1 over a is equal to 1 over 27 so let's cross multiply these numbers so this will become a times 1 is simply a is equal to and 1 times 27 is simply 27 so here we will get the value of a that is 27 so a is equal to 27 is our answer and value of a in this interesting exponential math problem here we will try to verify this value of a that is a is equal to 27 is the exact and correct value of a in this problem or not so we will verify this value here So let's verify.
No, to verify the value of he we are here, we will write our problem again. Our problem is 3 s to power a is equal to a s to power 9. So here we will place a with 27. So it will become 3 s to power 27 is equal to 27 s to power 9. Now here we will try to make both sides the same. So for that we will leave this side as the same and we will do some changes here in the left hand side. So next we can write this power 27 as 3 to power 27 but 27 can be written as 3 times 9 which is 27 is equal to and this side will be the same 27 as to power 9. Now here the left hand side we will use an exponential identity so therefore we can write this as this will become 3 to power 3 whole to power 9 is equal to 27 as to power 9. So what is 3 to power 3? 3 to power 3, 3 times 3 is 9 and 9 times 3 is 27. So it is simply 27 raised to power 9 is equal to 27 raised to power 9. Now since both sides are equal, so it means that a is equal to 27 is the exact and correct value of a in this nice and interesting exponential method.